cow. Kid, you do realize you can run after her, right? Instead of just standing here, watching her go away. Oh, yeah. Samson, but she's gone and I can't be bothered. And you just proved my point. So do you want to go follow her, despite being the lazy ass you are? Well, she knows more about me than anyone, and those weirdo sickles. Except for you, of course, Samson. That being said, though, I think we should just see what else she knows about my past. Then we kick her ass? Filio, rule 34 states... Wait. Wait. Hold on. Your voice. Huh, Samson? Mmm. Uh, you feel anything weird happening? Like what, Samson? Like... Our voices sound more clearer and less grating on the ears. Someone's gonna be happy with that. Really? I hadn't noticed. Uh, forget it. So good. Anyway, what were we talking about? Oh yeah, you don't hit people who used to be your friends. Besides, we ain't savages. We only kick the asses of people who look like they have a nice figure, okay? Don't know if that applies to Leviathan, though. <laughs> Who's making fun of me? Leviathan, dear. What is wrong? Are you hallucinating again? I'm not sure. I just... I feel like someone just took the piss out of me. With no slight remorse in the voice. <clears throat> I wouldn't worry about it. Now, onwards to the Opera House. It'll be so good to hear electro orchestral compositions again. Shall we? Let's. Saying that though, it's pretty hard not to find that around here. Everyone looks so freaking awesome! Even the traps. Oh, alright. Are you sure you didn't just make that up? Less shop and more walking, kid. And remember, gotta be aware for that red-haired chick. Whatever you say. Oh, Leviathan, that was so wonderful! The colorful, sweet sounds of the clarinets, and then the lovely brass. Oh, and the coup de gras! Such heavenly compositions. I concur wholeheartedly, my lady. Don't forget the enchanting synthesizer after the wonderful acoustic solo. Oh, yes, yes. So much to see, so much to hear. Now, what shall we... Was that your stomach, sweetheart? Hmm, well, I don't have a lot of those delectable cakes, so who knows? Who are you? Wow! Look at you! Look at you! You look absolutely stunning! Just look at that shuriken wheel attached to her. Those veins, hair, and skull clips and that mask as well. Really nice touch. Is there a festival going on right now? Uh, Squiggly? Yes, love? Perhaps you should keep your indulgence to a minimum at the moment. Oh yes, my apologies. You just look so cool. You could almost be one of these cool, deformed anti-heroes from those comic books. Uh, thanks? Uh, forgive her once more, miss. Uh, she tends to get quite overly joyous when she sees something like this. I'm not that bad. Anyway, are you doing okay? You seem a bit under the weather. Do you have a name? I... I... Uh, feel... Phil? Huh. Odd name. No! Not me! Oh, it must be someone else then. I must digress though, I've never heard of a person called Phil. Uh, have you, Squiggly dear? No, love. Well, from what I can remember anyway, we've only been awake for half a day now, but anyway, is this person you speak of a friend? No! No? Then... No, not Phil... Philly. Philly? Ah, I see. Are you trying to recount their name? No. No to that as well. No, I I remember her name is Philly. Ah, music! Stop music! Stop music? I don't know what you. Ah! Oh, what was the meaning of that? Uh, I didn't mean. No! Leviathan. I believe she's being controlled by someone. I can feel a presence. Hmm. I feel it too. An out of reach aura. We apologize, miss. You just need to calm down, spiky girl. Must get away! Hold on! We can help! Men, we found one of them. Capture and detain her. Sir, yes, sir. Of all times. Wait, where did she. Squiggly. We need to make a swift getaway. Right. Forgive us, Spiky Girl.
Don't let her escape. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Right. Consider it done. Oh, yeah, I'm good. Just dandy. I'll get back in touch later. Valentine out. Finally. <sighs> now, my little sweet brown bar, it's just you, me, and... <laughs> Okay. Let's... Huh? Didn't... How... Oh, you've got to be... Kidding me. You... Painwheel, what are you doing here? Voice. Different. Not surprised. <laughs> it's a good match for... Touché. Music! Stop music. You're a big girl now. Come on, you can fight it. You... Yeah! Oh, well. Now I'm gonna have to ask you to- Valentine. Great. Yes, Marie, I'm here. What is it now? Double has requested you to turn a bit early from your midnight stroll, though I can't imagine why. Sore loser. Uh, likewise, uh, informer will be along shortly. As you wish. But remember, I'm going for a rest, so keep quiet, the both of you. You know, you go for a rest, you just stare intensely at your vacuum. What was that? I said, uh, have a nice time in limbo, dear Marie. Hmm. Enjoy your squabble. Change of plans, garden girl. You're unfortunately coming with me. This is the place? This is the place. Really dark around here. Yeah, still looks nice though. <sighs> Definitely. You sure you're feeling all right? The circus freaking cat chick didn't. I'm fine, Sam. Sam? Huh? Pardon? You said. Samson? Ah, uh, uh, never mind. Let's go say hi. Right. The future ain't looking pretty.